Hello everyone, Tam and Desmond here bringing back more Kingdom Hearts. In the last episode, we just finished up Atlantica. Now we're going to start off our next world. I don't even know what it was. <laughs> oh wait, no, no, wait, no, 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 no. We're not going to move on just yet. We're going to head back to Traverse Town because remember we found a torn page and I want to see what what new mini game we got for the Way of the Pooh world. I'm here, Traverse Town. Do 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 do. It's a magician today. Ah, crap. The melon? Yes. Never mind. Uh, <laughs> um, let's see. I wonder if I can talk to the fairy godmother. Not hit her. Well, this, oh, okay, so there's nothing to that except for just. I really like the high jump ability, actually. Hmm. Okay, let's hop in the Pooh's world again. Let's see what he and the others are up to. A broad expanse of vegetable fields. Take a look. Sure. Okay. Nobody's home, and I'm out of honey. Look, Rabbit's house came back, but it looks like Rabbit isn't home. Pooh's been calling and calling, but the house says that no one's there. Um, if a house starts talking, I only doubt it's because nobody's home. That's right, nobody. Nobody's home. Okay, no one. Um. Let's enter his house. Who's this person named Nobody? <laughs> His house is, is, is... The freaking spelling's off. Nobody. Have you seen Rabbit? No. No Rabbit here. There's, there's no one here. Rabbit's house is spelled wrong. Hello, Rabbit. Bye. Ooh, what a pleasant surprise. Nice to see you too, Piglet, and... Is this a new friend? Uh, my name's Sora. Uh, poo, poo but I'm sorry, but... I'm out of honey, out of honey for the moment. Let's talk to Rabbit. I have nothing to give Pooh. Don't waste your time looking around. Okay. Let's, uh, wait. Explain the giant honey. Explain the honey jar up there. H honey? How'd that get up there? Would you like some Pooh? Don't feel you have to, of course. Oh, thank you, Rabbit. I was in luck. I would like just a small smacker. I'm quite hungry. Um, Pooh Bear? You're not eating the whole pot, are you? Jesus Christ! <laughs> Once you start, there's no stopping you, is there? Um... Why not, Rabbit? Um... 
I'm so glad you found both the rabbit and some honey. Manny the Pooh, hopefully don't get any copyright stuff from the guy who did this. Oh, I'm out of honey again. What's oh, this, their fucking currency now? Pooh's eating your money! Stop him! <laughs> um, ah, I keep on stepping on Piglet. So, so, Rabbit, Rabbit came back too, but someone's missing. And some place in the Hundred Acre Wood are gone too. Oh, what to do? I can't do it, Piglet. I just can't. I think we need to head back in Rabbit's house. I don't know what else to do here. I forget. What? Okay, so Pooh's just saying the same thing. Um. Huh. Um. I'm sorry. I'm being very quiet right now, guys. I'm just, very, I'm just singing and like. An email. A letter inside. I hope. I hope we find him. How did you get this soon? Pooh. Um. I swear that that is just wrong. Is this what if? Rabbit's supposed to be the most intelligent one of the show, of the series of Winnie the Pooh. He's obviously not very intelligent if he's just misspelling his name. What do I do? I don't remember. Stop popping up behind them, though. I want to talk up front and personal. Do I leave? I'm confused. Do I leave? Hmm, I wonder if I leave. Oh, here we go. Help, but please, Poo. Oh, it's Piglet. What happened? I hear weird music. Oh! Oh, help me, Bother. I'm stuck again. I can't believe this hole. So it must have shrunk. to do all oh, this because you can't stop up liking honey so much if Pooh didn't slim down I also would stay plugged up forever if only there were something we could do okay I was about to leave the damn place because Pooh is too busy eating his damn honey Stuck here. Oh. When it's lunch time, perhaps you could bring me a honey jar. No honey until you un. Oh, no, that was the rabbit. No honey until you unstuck. If poo, poo didn't swim down, my house would stay plugged up forever. If only there were something we could do. <laughs> Wait, I know. A bit of carrot top juice could do, would do the trick. I have a carrot patch on the other side of the stream. What carrot top is the tank is slimming down a poo. Oh no! What? What's wrong? 
Uh oh. It's Tigger. Jesus Christ, Tigger! <laughs> hey there! Name's Tigger! T I double G R. That spells Tigger! Well, now, I don't think I've ever seen you before. Hello, Tigger. You've just bounced my new friend, Sora. Hey, Pooh. Say, you're looking mighty uncomfy today. Is that some new exercise? Why, bouncing around is a lot more fun. Bounce around so much, Tigger. Why? Because bouncing's what Tiggers do best. Speaking of which, my bouncing spot has gone and disappeared. So for now, this will be my new bouncing ground. <laughs> <laughs> ah, the old nostalgia. I remember watching Winnie the Pooh as a kid, being like, oh god. Tigger is bouncing while we ruin my vegetables. If we don't give Pooh some carrot top juice, he'll be stuck forever. Please help me keep Tigger away from my carrots. This is quite a fix, but I have just the solution. Pay attention now. What the fuck? Owl was kinda. So, uh. You have this. You have to protect this carrot patch. If Tigger bounces on a carrot twice, it will be buried. Once. Twice. Just like that. Protect the carrots from Tigger's bounces and you'll receive points. How you ask? It's elementary. Simply get to the carrot before Tigger lands on him. There are 15 carrots here. Your score depends on how many you save and how many times you've logged Tigger. Oh, and one more thing. The rush command is the key to high score. Select rush while near a carrot that isn't protected yet. Buried yet. You dash to that target area before Tigger lands. Well, good luck. So pretty much what we gotta do here, guys, we gotta watch out for Tigger's bouncing. Because if Tigger bounces on a carrot twice, it's done. You can't get it up. <laughs> Block Tigger. Beat Tigger to the carrots before he bounces him into the ground. <laughs> now see, he'll, he'll bounce him right there. Unless you fuck up like an idiot, like I did. Shit. Oh, I blocked him. Gotcha, Tigger. Yeah, this is like one of the ones that, that has the rush command being pretty handy. Except for circumstances right there where I fucked it like an idiot. <laughs> Damn it. Damn it, Tigger. How many carrots did I save? 10, 12, huh? 120. Say, you kept up pretty good there, Sora. Especially for a non-tigger. Let's have another go. <laughs> I guess I did it. Thank you so much. 
Now I better make that carrot top juice. I'll get carrot. I'll get the carrot. So wait, and please wait inside the house. Okay, okay, I'll wait inside the house. Oh, what a day! I gave Pooh the carrot top juice. <coughs> All we have to do now is push him out. Just a little push to do. Don't worry, Pooh, I'll help you. He's... Ho! Whee! <laughs> well... That certainly did it. There's my vegetable patch and now this. so dark in here. Well, it isn't so bad, I suppose. <laughs> there is plenty of honey. <laughs> Aww. Dun -dun. <laughs> the torn page turned into a nude item. A um, nude item. Mm, that's, weird. that's weird. Um, But anyway, I turned into a mythal shard, and now I think we can get out here. I think, hang on, let me look around. There's Pooh's house. Yeah, I'm not seeing anything else, you guys. Um, well, that most of that episode was just trying to block Terra from getting a fucking carrot into the ground. Um, that was just a, one, of, a, one of the many bonus episodes. I'm not sure if I might. I might. I don't, I don't know. I'm trying. I'm trying to debate either I, if I want to collect all the poo pages or not. Um, I don't know. We'll see about it. I'm not too sure. Because, like I said, I'm not going for a 100% completionist route, you know. Oh, man, I'm so confused. I'm puzzled. <laughs> Let's just head back to the gummy ship and head to another world. Because I wasted way too much time here. I'll see you guys as soon as we get there. And I'm back. <laughs> so now we're going to be heading off to Halloween Town. Bet you guys can guess what movie this is from. This sure is a spooky place. I bet the people here are scary looking too. Don't worry, we look spooky too. If they scare us, we can scare them right back. You think so? So yeah, now we're here in uh, Halloween Town, which is based on the Nightmare Before Christmas movies. Well, no, not movies, there's only one movie. I don't know what the fuck I'm saying anymore. Um... <clears throat> Yeah, but I've recorded for a little long. Um, so, yeah, I'm going to end this episode off right here. Like and subscribe if you want to see more. I'll see you guys next time where we will explore Halloween Town. Seven,